Municipal police officers from the industrial area sub-county have apprehended a group of intruders who unlawfully entered Highway Secondary School on Saturday morning, targeting the staff quarters. So the suspects were acting at the behest of a private developer claiming ownership of the school's land and attempted to forcibly expel the school's teachers. The land tussle between the school and the private developers persisted for close to three years now. The group of intruders reportedly following orders from a private developer executed the raid when most of the staffers were away on holiday, targeting their residences and causing extensive damage to their property. This is a, a school land and uh, I think uh, these people waited when uh, teachers have gone away for the um, Christmas festivities so that they can come and... Uh, uh, throw out and uh, dismantle uh, whichever property and remove whatever they have here. Prompt police intervention led to the apprehension of several individuals involved in the Saturday morning incident. What we don't know is that uh, who sent these people here because uh, this, is, uh, this is highway secondary school property. A long-standing dispute over a parcel of land in South B area of Nairobi persists between the private developer and the school dating back to 2020. The private developer claims to have the title deed to the piece of land, with the school on the other hand maintaining it was allocated the land by the government in 1974. About three years ago, we had uh, someone uh, purporting that had uh, acquired a title deed to this piece of land and wanted us to be evicted. I've been uh, residing in the highway staff quarter uh, from uh, 1990. Uh, since then there have been no any problem and uh, we have been uh, paying for electricity and power and uh, there has never been any problem. In May of this year, students at the school in solidarity with the Board of Management staged demonstrations against the threats from the private developer to encroach upon the institution's land. The Ministry of Lands and the Nairobi County Government are yet to pronounce themselves on the school land. Ben Kirui, Citizen TV, Nairobi.